Um, asking about the dome. Um, yes. what, about, what about meteorites? I mean, I know people who have got meteorites who have seen meteorites and land on their property. That is, they that come, was they come literally, that was, yeah, the meteorites. That was literally the first question I ever got, oh. ever got from my clues. Uh, it was an email. They said, what about meteorites? Yeah. Uh, it's just part of the mechanical system. Whoever runs this place fires in meteorites, use some sort of railgun technology, metal ore, trying to not to aim at cities. If you can help it, try not to make them too big. Interesting, by the way, we don't get any decent shots in, in the water or we have any decent footage. There's 6 billion smartphones. No one's showing any, any um, impacts while they're happening, but that's neither here nor there. Um, so no, it's just part of the mechanical system. So they, the creator, the yeah, whoever's running this place, they're firing them in for fun. Is purposefully shooting rocks. So that would imply... Throw, to me, throwing water into an aquarium. How's that? Yeah, sure. Throwing that, rocks into an aquarium. That would imply to me that this creator, this uh, whatever, the, the beings who are, are still active here, and yeah. they basically want us to think it's a globe. Because why would they do stuff like that, which leads most people to thinking this is a globe? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You do want to, you do want to, to make this thing seem like a globe. You absolutely do. So if there is a creator, yeah, or a, or a Santa Claus, as you said, with gifts, yeah, who wants <laughs> us to know we're special and not yeah. just um, uh, life without meaning, I think is what we talked about before. Right. Um, why would they keep that a secret? Why would they want to not know that we were special and we had this? The head that 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 this whatever this entity had gifted us this right. had meaning. Why would they try and so you're basically saying they're a part of the conspiracy because they're firing meteorites around to try and trick us into thinking they're coming from space. Not a conspiracy as much as a test. Meaning, I think we were eventually going to figure this thing out, uh, but you can't. You just can't give it to us. Meaning, uh, the easiest way to get keep people from going to the fence, going to the wall, or looking for the edge of the earth is to tell them there is no edge there is no there's no there's no possible way out you're on a sphere you're on you're not going anywhere. it's like running around an ant running around the apple you run around the apple all day long you're not going anywhere um but eventually we were going to figure it out it's kind of like um hiding cigarettes from your roommate oh yeah you can move it around here and there but sooner or later you're gonna find them doesn't that sound really narcissistic to you though that there's this creative whatever entity that yeah. is wanting us wanting everyone to be tricked for some special few to figure out what it is because eventually we're going to figure it out. Surely, you know, I'm a, I'm a parent. I want yeah. to give my, my children a gift and I want them to yeah. enjoy it and I want them to understand it. I don't want to kind of put it in the ceiling that maybe three years from their birthday, they'll actually discover it and figure out it was from their dad. Three. That's years. good. That's good. I like that. Uh, no, I, I, I believe that some lessons have to be lived and they can't be told. And it, that's what I think it is with us. I think, I don't, I don't think this world is necessarily, uh, an entertainment system, nor do I think it's a prison planet. I see it as kind of like a school. Right. And we've been trying to learn things along the way. And I think this eventually will be revealed to everybody sooner or later. Uh, but with us, I... You think that's where a lot of the religious beliefs comes in? There's, as you see, the Christian world seems to be connected to this more so than any other any other belief yeah yeah they they do i mean there's there's well i mean heck the, the, they were the first ones to jump straight into most of the biblical text and you know rob skiba was one of them and there was only one verse that even hinted even literally one verse that hinted at any sort of globe model and yet the, there's a lot of pastors out there that are that are holding on to it like it has veto power or everything else even though genesis I, you know, I'm not going to quote too much chapter and verse. Genesis uh, 1, 7, 1, 8, that, you know, uh, that create, you know, creates, create a firmament that separate the waters above and waters below, which, by the way, uh, let's throw one more in out of that, you, which is what is on the tombstone of Werner von Braun? No idea. It's just his, his name, Yuri was born, Yuri died, and it says literally Psalms 19.1. I didn't know what it was. I had to look it up. But when you look it up, it says, and the firmament shows his handiwork. I thought that was interesting for the father of NASA. Bible also says we shouldn't eat pork or wear mixed linens. Do we listen to that? Some do. <laughs> I, I, I like bacon. I'm never giving up bacon. 